solve for x, s raised to power 4x is equal to 1 divided by square root of 2 raised to power 1 divided by x. Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of x from this given equation. We have s raised to power 4 s is equal to 1 divided by root of 2 raised to power 1 divided by x. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation. S raised to power 4 s is equal to 1 divided by square root of 2 raised to power 1 divided by x. Let's multiply the exponent of both sides by x. Then we have s raised to power 4s multiplied by x is equal to 1 divided by square root of 2 raised to power 1 divided by x multiplied by x. Then this one will cancel dx. We have s raised to power 4x times s, that is 4s square is equal to 1 divided by square root of 2 Again, let's divide the exponents of both sides by 4. Now remember that here is also raised to power 1. Then we have x raised to power 4x squared multiplied by 1 over 4 raised to power 1 divided by 4. Then this for we cancel dx we have s raised to power s square is equal to 1 divided by root 2 raised to power of 1 divided by 4 now remember that if you have square root of 2 is the same thing as 2 raised to the power 1 divided by 2, that is half. Then we have x raised to the power s square is equal to what? This one become 1 divided by 2 raised to the power 1 over 2, then multiply by this 1 over 4. Then we have s raised to power s square is equal to what? 1 divided by 2 raised to power of 1 divided by 4 times 2, that is 8. At this point, we're going to perform a trick so that if you are multiplying 1 by any number, you are going to get the number back. Now, if you multiply 1 by 1 million, you're going to get that 1 million back. Now, in this, uh, the equation at the right-hand side is going to be multiplied by 2 divided by 2. Because 2 divided by 2 is what? 1. Now, let's see. We have s raised to the power s squared will be equal to what? 1 divided by 2 raised to the power of 1 divided by 8 multiplied by 2 divided by 2 because 2 divided by 2 is 1. Then from here we have s raised to power s square is equal to this 1 divided by 2 that is half raised to power 1 times 2 that is 2 then 8 times 2 that is 16. Now we want to bring these two in because we can also bring it in. Then we have s raised to power s square will be equal to 1 divided by 2 
all square, then raised to the power of what? 1 divided by 16. Now, we have s raised to the power of s square will be equal to 1 square is what? 1 divided by 2 square, that is 4 raised to the power of 1 divided by 16. That is from here we have, if you have 1 over 2 all square, it seems in as 1 square raised to the power of 2 square, which is equal to what? 1 square is 1 and 2 square is what? 4. Then we have, I repeat again, s raised to the power of s square will be equal to what? 1 over 4 raised to the power of 1 divided by 16. Now, but 1 divided by 16 can be rewrite as we have 1 over 16, the same thing as 1 over 4 all square. That is, if you have 1 over 4 all square, it's going to be 1 over 16, that is 1 square. We have 1 square divided by 4 square, which is going to give you 1 divided by 16 back. Now, let's substitute back into the equation. Then we have s raised to power s square will be equal to what? Here is, we have 1 divided by 4, there is the power of 1 divided by 4, all square. Now we can see that this square, we cancel this square, then we are left with s raised to the power of s is equal to 1 divided by 4 raised to the power of 1 divided by 4. Now by comparing, we have this one is here is s is equal to 1 divided by 4, and here is s is equal to 1 divided by 4. Therefore, we have s is equal to 1 over 4. And our final answer is s is equal to 1 over 4. That is our final answer. Then, from the given question, we have to find the value of x. We want to solve for x. And from s raised to the power of 4x is equal to 1 divided by root of 2 raised to the power of 1 divided by s. Therefore, our final answer is s is equal to 1 divided by 4. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.